Welcome back to Tech Vault Academy for the final objective of our A plus Core 1 review series. Today we're tackling objective 5.6, troubleshooting printer issues. Printer problems can be frustrating, but with a good detective strategy, you can solve any case. Your first step in troubleshooting is to isolate the problem. A great way to do this is with a test page. A test page from your Windows, Settings, Tests the OS and Driver. A test page printed directly from the printer's own controls tests only the hardware. Comparing the two is a powerful clue. Let's look at print quality issues. If you see lines down the printed pages, it's often a clogged print head on an inkjet printer or a scratch on the photosensitive drum in a laser printer. If your prints are faded, you're likely low on ink or toner. For garbled print, where you get random, nonsensical characters, the issue is likely a bad or incorrect printer driver or a mismatch in the printer language, like sending PCL to a PostScript printer. Try reinstalling the correct driver. Speckling on pages or double echo images from a laser printer usually points to a problem with the optical drum not being cleaned properly during the print process. This often means the drum or toner cartridge needs to be replaced. Next up, paper handling problems. If paper is not feeding correctly, or you get a multi-page misfeed, the pickup rollers are probably dirty or worn out. Cleaning or replacing them is the fix. For paper jams, always remove the paper carefully without tearing it. Even a tiny scrap left behind can cause future jams. A grinding noise is often a symptom of a paper jam or another physical obstruction. Let's talk about job management and configuration. If you have multiple prints pending in queue or a frozen print queue, the printer spooler service in your operating system has likely crashed, often due to a corrupted print job. You'll need to go into the print queue, delete the bad job, and restart the spooler service. If the printer reports that a tray is not recognized, make sure the tray selected in your print driver matches the physical tray and the paper size you're trying to use. And if you get an incorrect page orientation, check the orientation settings in both your application and your print driver defaults. And don't forget connectivity issues. If your network printer isn't responding, use your standard network troubleshooting. Check the IP configuration, check the network cable, and look for link lights on the printer's network port. Finally, some printers have finishing issues. If you're getting staple jams or problems with a hole punch, your best bet is to check the printer's documentation for the specific procedure to clear the jam or configure the feature. So for your a exam, here are the main ideas. Start by isolating the problem with test pages. For print quality issues like lines, fading, or garbled text, investigate the ink toner, print heads, drum, or drivers. For paper handling issues like jams and misfeeds, check the paper path and the pickup rollers. A frozen print queue is almost always a crashed spooler service in the OS. And for connectivity issues, use your network troubleshooting basics to check the printer's IP and physical connection. That's a wrap on Objective 5.6 and on the entire A+, 1201 Core 1 exam. Congratulations on making it through. Thanks for studying with Tech Vault Academy.